Goodbye. Hey, I got my second raid finished. Uh, this time I went with my uh, friends Astra and Mary J again, but I went with my other friend uh, Jenskin. And uh, believe it or not, I only died once. Oh, we got a... Oh, we got the tablet! Is that the teleport? Is that the teleport? I don't know what I do with that, but I think I use it on the Xerox Talisman. I have the teleport to this place. Oh my god. That's amazing. All right, well, um... Wow. Okay, second raid uh, was a lot better. 41 minutes compared to the last 56. All right, so you use the tablet on the talisman. Yep, that works. So now I can teleport to Xerix Honor, and it brings me right here. So I don't have to run all the way with the minecarts anymore. Oh, my God. It's also a very quick bank, so I'm going to probably use this a lot more often. That's actually fantastic. I had chivalry on. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. <laughs> New meta. Damn. I got 20k points. I was actually a good member. Holy hell. I got a fourth of the points. Nice. I didn't die at all that raid. First no death raid. Nice. We are improving, boys. We are improving. I didn't even make that low amount either. That's pretty good. Another good raid. 21k points. Didn't die again. Two in a row. That was pretty good. I was so close to dying there. I died during... um. I died during Tecton because we had a very bad RNG or muted aisles, and then I ran out of food at Tecton. I got hit by 20s constantly. It was gross. Anyway, good raid. Otherwise, I've had this drop before. Either way, guys, I'm very happy with the progress we've been making. I am most excited about this telly, though. Look at that. Uh, I'm so happy. Next time I go to raid, it's not going to be that big of a deal. There's a few things I do want to upgrade. I do want to get... Uh, I kept them forgetting to put rune darts into my blowpipe. You don't really need them, but it definitely gave me an edge. Uh, and I just gotta keep on focusing on not like going crazy at all. The third and fourth raid I did fairly well. Uh, the last one it was pretty bad, but progress is progress, guys. And don't get me wrong, guys. I'm not doing raids right now for money. Uh, if I get a drop, that's awesome, but that's not what I'm shooting for. I'm mainly just trying to get good. So I'm not like gonna be mad if I don't get anything, at least anytime soon. But yeah, tomorrow, get back into Slayer. We need to, need to keep on working that. We need 99 pronto. Alrighty, I got a boss task of Kelphite Queen, so we'll see if we get anything. Alrighty, finish the task. Unfortunately, okay, back-to-back, -back, same exact drops. Super anti boys in the graves, okay. We did have to do a bit more KQ before we can go make the video. I'll just do it on the next Kelphite task. That was easy, though. Nothing really exceptional. Dude, I always get Cerberus tasks. This is amazing. 138, easy. Hopefully uh, a primordial or two. No, I just started. Damn it, start with a vacation. That's the second kill of the task too. Whatever, all right, moving on. Let's get something better. Nice, got an elite. I'm feeling a master. Oh, I knew it. I knew we got a master. I have no idea what this item is. A monocle? The hell do you do with a monocle? Either way, I am looking fine. <laughs> so I found out that I can put the monocle with the top hat, make a top hat monocle. Oh, shit. I think I have to talk to someone for that. <laughs> Who do I talk to? Patchy. Who's Patchy? Give me a moment. All right. Apparently, I bring it to this bad boy. Make the... Where's the top hat? What? I'm I'm actually the most blind person on the planet. There was an arrow. Okay. Uh. Yep. <laughs> There you go, top hat monocle. I'm spending so much time on this, but I look fancy. <laughs> that was totally not worth my time. That was an absolute nightmare. It was an eight step master with two hot and colds. There was a, a three stepper. And the first step was the um, Pharaoh Scepter one, which sucks. Anyway, please be good. It's actually pretty good. All right, I'll take it. That is so beautiful on the ground. Another crystal, this time Eternal. Can never complain about that second best crystal. It's going up so much. 4.7 mil. Damn. The, the first one I got, I believe, was like 3.6 or 3.8. That's so nice because uh, I have three of them now. Holy shit. How many crystals am I going to get? This is six kills after the last one. Fourth Pegasian. Man. Why can't you be a primordial? Hopefully the cloth's finished here. Oh my god, I think I maxed out. 521 XP drop. There you go. Server's task finished once again. And 
weirdly enough. <laughs> I ended on 666 kill count. And yeah, the amount of crystals I have is just stupid. Four Pagasians, three Eternals, one Primordial, one Smoldering. Like, that's just... That's just insane in this case here. And there you go, 97 magic quickly. Two more levels to go. I just need to keep on getting neck reels and dust devils and I'll get it in no time. All right, that is an interesting boss task. Barrows Brothers. Um, I've actually not really even done Barrows Brothers on, on this account. I think when they say number, I think that's number of actual brothers. So that would be, that'd be six chests. It's actually not 36 chests. If I'm correct on that, I'm not sure, but... Um, yeah, I actually had no reason to do Barrows in this account, and I love Barrows. one of my favorite content, or pieces of content in this game. Alrighty, that was pretty quick. Seventh chest, are we getting anything? Nah, but decent amount of runes. I would say the average was around 70k, and considering I did six chests, yeah, about 400k. With with regards to the supplies, I'd prop it around probably 350. Dude, the, the Cerberus luck is insane. That's near max right there. No way. <laughs> a dragon med helm. Okay. Alrighty then. Hello. 95 strength. Cerberus is just too damn good. My god. <laughs> it happened again. Wow, that's the second one today, actually. Uh, the earlier one from last task was earlier in the day. So, <laughs> okay. I will take that. That is the fourth... Eternal. That, that's so weird. We have four Eternals, four Pegasians, and one of the other ones. That's so weird. What are we going to get this... That's not what I wanted to say. What am I going to get from this piece of shit? Damn, I called it. Alright, this is probably going to come as a very unexpected turn, but... There you go. 99 HP. Didn't even have the time to absorb it, but... That is the third 99 on the account. All this Slayer I've been doing really has been packing that XP. And Cerberus is just insane XP, honestly. I've been saying that a lot. So, that was inevitable. I got it. It looks so nice. I love the HP cape. It's not something I use for, like, fashion too much. But it looks so good with, with really any of these type of gears. But yeah, I'm definitely, like, getting closer to the max combats. I mean, it's slow, but, like, I really only do it through bossing. So, like, range is going to finish. Mage is going to finish just passively. The only thing that's going to be a problem is going to be the defense, because I never really went and trained it. So we might have to go to Nightmare Zone for that in the future, but that's not too bad. And I may as well mention, because some people might be wondering, the HP cape actually is kind of useful, because it has a, uh, like, a restoration effect with your HP. Yeah, the uh, the natural HP restoration rate is doubled. So that also stacks with the regen bracelet, which what that does is it doubles the HP regen. Instead of one per tick, it's um, or every cycle, it's uh, two. So it's very good for that sort of thing. There's a few areas where that would be good, like Pyramid Plunder. Anything where you're, like, skilling constantly. Um, the best place I can think of for me would be the Solia set Mushrooms for woodcutting. You guys saw me do that, I think, in episode 48. Uh, when I go back there, HP cape is going to be really nice. What is up with my RDT, man? That's the third crazy RDT drop we've had. I had the Dragon Med Helm earlier. Uh, I didn't record it, but I had a Dragon Stone and now a Dragon Spear. What the fuck? That's not the drop I need. <laughs> what are the chances? What? Another Barrow's Brothers task? All right. I mean, I'm not going to complain. That's another six chests. Let's have some fun again. Hey, got our first item. Damn, Varric's Helm's pretty good. I will take that, 300K. I, I didn't even realize it. Yeah, that, that's kind of a meme on my channel, actually. If you guys watch my uh, RS3 Iron Man series, I got seven of those. Uh, it was my most common item. Jesus. It didn't like hit me right away because they look a lot different. Oh my God, the curse. Can we get back to back? No, all right. Wasn't too bad though. Six chests was roughly eh, 620k. That's not bad. That's not bad. Didn't even take that long. Ah, we got 84 defense and a superior killed. Same time. Nice. I swear, how did I miss this level? I got 95 Slayer. Uh, and I just got this Skeletal Wyverns task pretty quick. Just for some easy points. I don't really like this task too much. But um, yeah, four more levels, guys. Getting real close. Just having a nice day of runecrafting, and we got 83 crafting. 
That's really not that bad. I think there's a uh, master requirement, like master clue for 87. I believe so. So if I can like slowly get to that just from runecrafting, that would be amazing. I believe that marks two levels since I started this at 77. Ah, it just occurred to me. Uh, that was the 400th task. I just finished a trolls task pretty quick. Uh, but yeah, 400 tasks in a row, 375 points. I actually needed that. Puts me over a thousand finally. Um, so if I do end up getting like an Abbey Demon Head or something, I can uh, get the Red Slayer Helm now. Just got an Elite Clue from Abbey Demons. I think that's one in 1200. I'm down. Alrighty. Eh, pretty average, I guess. Yo! I had a feeling. I had a feeling. Thank you for the whip. Um, that's so beautiful because they are three mil now. Uh, Raids 2 really shot the Bissel Whip up. Um, because the Tentacle Whip is the best in slot item outside of the Scythe for Verzik. But that's awesome, man. So we just got a massive Kelphite task. Thank God I only have to kill, I think, 14 Kelphite Queens. And then I'll be done with um, that boss. Then go back to normal cannoning them. I'm now over 1,000 KC. I now have 1,000 Kelphite Queen kills logged. Uh, so we're done. We're done with this boss. That was a fun time. Uh, we got a lot of KQ heads, but no pet. That's fine. We'll continue this boss on the Iron Man. Feels good to be back here. That's a pretty good hard clue. Easy Zammy page. Dude, what is my task look today? We had the Cal fights, uh, and then we had Sukas, and then Cal fights again. Just so much Slayer experience. Loving it. I've been debating a little bit. I'm actually going to extend my uh, Sukas, because... They're, okay, they're a really boring task, but they're really good Slayer experience. I think it's like 50k an hour when you cannon. And Duradel doesn't really assign that much. So we're going to extend it. I think that puts it over to like 200 per task. That was quick since upgrading to extend it. That's really funny. More experience for me. Back to back pretty good clues. Thank you for the Ancient Dehyde. As per usual, let's grab a rune crafting level. Oh, we're really getting up there, guys. 87. One more. And I'm going to go grab the diaries. But yeah, as you saw, I've been doing a lot more Slayer. And you saw the change from like doing too many boss tasks now that I finish KQ. Uh, and I'm nearing the finish of DKs. I'm actually starting to do a lot of normal tasks again to really push for my Slayer. And here's the deal, guys. For the next month, I'm going to go really, really hard to get this 99 Slayer. Like I'm going to do pretty much everything in my power to get that as fast as possible. So the videos might be a little bit more sp spread out because of that. Because if you're doing power slaying, it's really not that many clips. But I really want to get this over with. So then this account's goals will just basically be maxing raids and Zolra. Definitely expect a lot more just normal slayer tasks. And uh, it's gonna be great finishing the skill up. And it'll probably go even faster than a month, honestly, if I go really hard. Because once I hit 88 runecrafting, um, I'm gonna probably switch my AFK time to AFKing tasks instead of this. And I know it might sound kind of lame that I'm stopping some bosses, do not worry. There will be a new series coming up within the next month, so watch out for that as well. I'll give you guys more information as it goes along. If you watch my streams, you probably know what I'm talking about. With that though, if you want to check out my live stream, the link will be in the description for my Twitch. Come over and say hi. Either way, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will see you in the next one. Have a good day.